Okay, imagine that we draw a pattern here and we have our pattern and we want to arrange it around the avatar. This is our avatar. Okay, going here and make it up the window full 3D. Okay, the manual way is, for example, this is a pattern of the front. You can manually bring it at the front and also this going and manually bring it back to swing that these are sleeves and as you can see uh, we have front and the back as you can see we have the front and back this is the front this is uh, white bright and this is the back of the of fabric or pattern that's the black as you, as you can see the back of the pattern has to face in the body of the avatar. So we, you have two ways. You can rotate it like this, or you can simply right click and flip horizontal or flip vertical. If you flip vertical, it's flip it in this direction. But we need flip horizontal, control G. As you can see, it's flipped. And everything is connect, uh, correct. And we can swing the part that we want to each other. But Ctrl Z, the best way to doing that is arrangement point. You can hold and shift and select them, click anywhere and make them. Okay, let's talk about this. If you're going here, a uh, button that's like avatar, this is a control of uh, the button that control the avatar. Now we want to explain the show arrangement point. If you click it, as you can see, a lot of arrangement points uh appear around our avatar it means you can arrange or you can wrap or bend your pattern based on this point for example this is a front pattern i want to uh bring it uh at the front it's very easy select your pattern going your most over one of these points it's automatically a ghost will be appear that means okay if you want to place your pattern here it looks like this simply going almost over that and then click and as you can see it's automatically wrapped and flipped and bent around that position another select it i want to wrap it exactly in this direction as you can see just click and as you can see it's automatically wrapped bent and flipped so this is the best way like these sleeves going there and i want it nice and because of the symmetry, it will be rotate. And that's nice. And after that, you can you can select it and wrap it anywhere that you want. Like this, like this. Nice. Okay. And after that, you can swing that. This is an arrangement point. If you select some pattern, if you select in here, this is a fabric. It means the fabric that you use. You can go <clears throat> your fabric library here, and we have lots of fabric that are explain it. Don't worry. For example, this fabric, you can click and drag it here. This is our denim fabric. It has its special properties here. If you select this fabric, we have a speci special properties here. But uh, if you select one of the patterns, we have a different information uh, properties of them here. And I will be explaining them one by one. But at the bottom of these properties, we have an arrangement <clears throat> part that this arrangement part is uh, aiming this arrangement. It means that pattern, that pattern is snapped to the this arrangement. As you can see, we have a lot of uh, arrangement point that it is these points. Select pattern again. And it means, okay, this pattern snapped to this point. It means this point, this point here. And the shape of the style is curved. You can set it flat. As you can see, you can set it the curve. You can change the position of X, position of Y, offset from the body. Let's see it. Offset from body and the orientation. 
For example, these sleeves, you can change the orientation in this way that you want. Nice. So, if you select a fabric, this is overall fabric that you use in your pattern. And if you select one of the pattern, because you can assign, for example, this fabric to the, this pattern. Okay, you can simply click and drag it there. But if you select the pattern, we have an special sitting here. Select a line, simulation properties, fabric. As you can see, it means, okay, in this pattern, we assign this fabric to this pattern. I will explain them bound and sky, and this is an arrangement and miscellaneous here, something uh, about the meshes. So I want to tell you, we have a different properties when you select the fabric or when you select the uh, pattern. And in this case, I explained arrangement point. So you can go in here and turn off the show arrangement point and continue your working that this is in the final part that we have to swing the pattern to each other and it's the final part. Hello my friends, to continue these tutorials on YouTube, subscribe us, like us and hit the bell icon. And now you will be alerted about all of the amazing videos that we release.